The joules, or watt seconds, equal the power, that is the watts, times the duration in seconds, while the potential, that is the volts. I want all the energy I can get. I want the high energy. It's important for me to have maximum efficacy with the least possible energy. The question is, who delivers better first shock efficacy? Defibrillation shouldn't be confusing. It's really quite simple. Deliver enough current to depolarize myocardial cells and the heart's natural pacemaker regains control. You need the current. You want higher efficacy and lower risk. Zoll Rectilinear Biphasic has more current. Zoll delivers more current to high impedance patients at 200 joules than other biphasic defibrillators, even those that escalate to 360 joules. How is that possible? Energy settings can be misleading. Higher joules don't necessarily translate into higher efficacy. Here's why. The crucial component when you defibrillate patients is average current, especially crucial for high impedance hard to defibrillate individuals. Energy is simply the work required to deliver average current to the heart. Energy is the product of three components, voltage, times current times duration. So it's possible to have the same energy just by increasing duration and actually deliver less current to the heart. And there's another downside to increasing duration. Several studies demonstrate there's an optimal time for the duration of a defibrillation shock. Data confirm that a waveform longer than about 12 milliseconds requires more energy to achieve the same efficacy. So, adding joules by extending the time doesn't always increase shock efficacy. Go beyond the optimal duration, and you might say you're looking at faux joules. They look good, but they don't have real value. The only authentic way to improve shock efficacy is to deliver more average current within the optimal time. Only Zoll delivers the genuine article. In carefully controlled bench tests comparing biphasic waveforms, results show Zoll at 200 joules actually delivers more average current to high impedance patients than other biphasic waveforms at 360 joules. Zoll delivers more of what you need within the optimal time period. That's why Zoll has more efficacy. Only Zoll is cleared by the FDA to label their product as superior to monophasic waveforms for cardioversion of atrial fibrillation and defibrillation of high impedance ventricular fibrillation. In the electrophysiology lab, three studies of the ability to terminate ventricular fibrillation compare three biphasic waveforms to the common standard monophasic damp sine waveform. Only Zoll is statistically superior for first shock efficacy with hard to defibrillate high impedance patients with ventricular fibrillation. Three studies, three waveforms, one was superior. Three more separate clinical trials of atrial fibrillation compared the same biphasic waveforms to the common standard monophasic damp sine waveform. Only Zoll shows statistically superior efficacy for cardioversion of atrial fibrillation. Again, three studies, three waveforms, one was superior. And in a head-to-head -head comparison with physio control at 50, 100, and 200 joule settings, Zoll stands out again, demonstrating higher efficacy with less energy. It's real evidence in real people in real clinical settings. Zoll's waveform has been designed to provide maximum efficacy with minimum risk. No one knows exactly how much energy causes myocardial damage. Studies do confirm that peak current can harm the myocardium as well as health. These studies also show that longer duration waveforms can increase risk and the potential severity of myocardial dysfunction and injury. That's why Zoll developed the rectilinear biphasic waveform. Our rectilinear waveform provides the maximum possible average current, the current that defibrillates while providing the minimum possible peak current. In addition, 
our waveform duration is held at the optimum, minimizing exposure to potentially harmful long duration defibrillation shocks. Other brands of defibrillators offer higher energy settings, but they use longer duration shocks to get their results. Don't be misled by faux jewels. You want energy settings that deliver real value. Zoll's superior rectilinear biphasic waveform and proprietary electronics deliver more of what's needed when you need it. With lower risk for adverse events, you can expect better clinical results. More current, more efficacy, less risk. Zoll. It's about time.